What's up, bitches? Ladies and gentlemen, it is, without question, the greatest sports and entertainment event of all time. I'm not a racist. I'm going to slap your real mother across the... <laughs> Hello, boys. <laughs> I think LeBron's a dork. So that is why I am better than everyone in the world. Kiss my ass and suck my dick, everyone. It's a shame that he doesn't know what he's talking about. The Cheney Strike, where the gin is dry, but the pussies are flowing. Always remember, if you ain't first, you're last. I'm the best in the world. It's a man there's justice. I myself, I jerk off at least twice a day. Because I've got nothing here. You're giving me baseball and hockey, and I've got my keister blowing in the wind. I have nipples, Greg. Could you milk me? This is serious. I just sharded. But this is a big fucking day. Way to go, guys. If you smell what the rock is cooking. Welcome to the charity strike. And now the guys who put the ooh back in. Hey, stop drooling while staring at my tits, you asshole! Trigger Mike, Midlife Crisis, and Rebound. Oh, yeah. Merry Christmas, bitches. And a crappy new year. I mean, uh, happy. The fuck? Home Alone, remember? Uh Happy. Merry Christmas, you filthy app in the mall. 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 And a happy new year. Okay. Great view about Jones. Uh, that filthy app in the mall over there is Trigger Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Stuttering my pews. Stuttering your pews. And uh, midlife crisis. What's up, bitches? And joining us for this very special New Year's edition of the Charity Track. Oh, give it to me. Oh, wow. What do you want me to give to you? That music. Give me that orange and purple <laughs> music. Yeah. Uh-huh. You know what it is. Orange and purple, orange and purple, orange and purple, orange and purple. Orange and purple. Yeah. Uh-huh. Sorry, how'd that go? You know what it is. Orange and purple, orange and purple, 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 Don't steal mics. Uh-huh. You know what Stop it trying is. to kiss me. I'm not that drunk yet. <laughs> oh, Laker fan Dan's in the room. What's up, buddy? Hey, what's up, guys? Man, you like stole my thunder there. I, remember? That, that's all he knows how to do is yeah. steal thunder. purple. <laughs> oh, the God. Suns will always be in our shadow. You know. <laughs> they can have a better record, but uh, I want to see the ring count. Ooh, <laughs> and the Hall of Fame count. Ooh. Ooh. I, don't, I don't see any point guards in their Hall of Fame. <laughs> <laughs> what? At least not named Johnson. Uh, that's right. That's true. Actually, there aren't any. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Soon to be Steve Nash, though. No. no. Not, not. Two-time MVP. Kobe's not even a two-time MVP. Can you not break Dang. our equipment here? <laughs> That'd be great. Yeah, two-time finals MVP. That's yeah. right. Finals. Who needs a finals <laughs> when you can be a regular? Ask Peyton Manning. <laughs> Who needs the finals when you can be uh, regular season That's MVP. right. Ask Clayton Kershaw while you're at it, too. <laughs> yeah. Nash actually said yeah. if he gets in the Hall of Fame, he must wear a Mavericks jersey. <laughs> <laughs> that like six year stress He was a maverick yeah. Low blow Low blow Anyways welcome You hurt me deep <laughs> You cut me deep Shrek <laughs> You cut me deep uh, Anyways welcome in the show uh, This is just a special uh, We're not in the studio this week So we figured we'd give you something fun to listen to Edition And Manny Cherub and one elsewhere are getting quite a show in the chat. parts unknown? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the Undertaker's <laughs> the out Undertaker's there. The Undertaker's best friend. <laughs> the Undertaker Bobby, and, and the Ultimate Warrior are both in the chat room. Yeah, yeah. In parts unknown. Uh, anyways, we'll get right into basketball. I'm not going to play the music because this is already playing. It's good. Uh, so Reggie Miller was asked about the whole Kobe Bryant situation. You know, a couple weeks ago he passed Magic Johnson for all-time points. Reggie says that Jordan on his worst day is better than Kobe on his best. How do we feel about ten, that? He said ten times better. Yeah, yeah ten times. I remember Michael Jordan scoring eighty-one points like on his worst day, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, 
No. That, that didn't happen? No. Okay. Oh. I get the spirit of where Reggie Miller's coming from, is that Michael Jordan will always be better no matter what, is what he's right, trying to yeah. say. But it's ridiculous to say that on his worst day, he's ten times better than Kobe, because that's not true. Yeah. I mean, if, if that's the case, then uh, Dr. J is ten times better than Michael Jordan ever will be. Right, because on his best day, Kobe is a triple-double threat. Right. And that every day was, is better than Michael Jordan on his worst day, yeah. by far. Easily. I mean, Michael Jordan did have a couple of good games on the flu. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, he pulled through a couple of times with the flu. Made uh, go below his bitch. Yeah. I mean, can we like not pretend that he had he didn't have bad games? I mean, everyone just loves to just throw everything out. Like, you think Michael Jordan never, ever had a bad game ever in his <laughs> right. life. Right. 15 years gone, you forget about it. Exactly. Influential with that influenza, I tell you. <laughs> That's right. Seriously, it's that game in Utah with the flu, man. And here's my argument to Reggie Miller and everyone else that brings this kind of thing up. Except baseball. <laughs> yeah. Oh. yeah. Yeah. Tracy McGrady did better in baseball than Jordan. That's right. He won a game, I think. Yeah. Right? How do you oh, feel? He's got Jordan? a strike. No, he got a strikeout. Michael Jordan did too, but he was a hitter. So it did. <laughs> yeah, he got a lot of strikeouts. <laughs> was, was, he right a was he a hitter? Yeah, he was like a. He's outfield, I think, right? Yeah, outfielder. Was did he, he outfield? Did he do yeah, anything yeah. right? I mean, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. That's what I'm getting. You know, he came back to the NBA. That's what he did right. Yeah, that was the best move he could have made. So, uh, <sighs> fuck you, Reggie Miller. Orange and purple, orange and purple, orange and purple, orange and purple. Dr. Pepper, what? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Reggie's just jealous because Jordan and Kobe made him his bitch. Ooh. Yeah. He's also jealous that Kobe and Jordan together still have smaller ears. <laughs> <laughs> his big fucking ears, man. Uh-huh. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> uh, Phil Jackson was asked about the whole Tyson Chandler trade or, you know, give up, not trade, to the Mavericks. Uh, he says he's okay with the deal and that Tyson Chandler would not have helped the Knicks in their current situation. Yeah, I really thought a lot of Phil until he said that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he, him and Reggie Miller must have gotten together and be like, what can we say yeah. that'll get us in the news? There's not enough news going on right now. Right, let's, you let's say stir up some dirt. He's like, yeah. you say that Michael Jordan is ten times better than Kobe, and I'll say that Tyson Chandler wouldn't do shit for our team. So yeah. he's saying the Knicks would have four wins right now instead of five or uh, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Bullshit. Tyson yeah. Chandler, is he's the type of guy you want on the court. This just in, Phil Jackson says Carmelo Anthony, the best superstar of all time. So. <laughs> yeah. He is a superstar. That's, I think he's lost his mind. Yeah, he's fallen. Phil has lost his mind. Yeah, Just uh, like no ligaments in his knee, no brain in his head either. Who? Phil, Phil Jackson. How dare you? Yeah, I know. He's dating a really hot older woman. <laughs> Look, right. Having 11 <laughs> titles does not make you not crazy. E.T. walk and everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can we talk about his lady friend for a couple minutes? Yeah, this bus. How hot is Jeannie Bus at whatever oh, age man, she is? Yeah. How old is she? Like 80 and man. <laughs> oh, she's so Hansel right now. Wow. Well, was Jerry like three when he had her? Or what? <laughs> her and Hansel in a threesome. So hot That's right now. Hot. Yeah, she so hot is, right now. man. She, I think she's in her late 50s, early 60s. I hate it. I guess she's in my right. bed. <laughs> yeah. Right. I right. guess I do her to this song right here. <laughs> <laughs> If you remixed it, Mike would do Steve Kerr. <laughs> <laughs> For one year. For one year. For one year. <laughs> Just a year. Yeah. Uh, I guess I could hit the Google box and look up how old... Genie Bus is 53 years old. Wow. Hey. Yeah. She looks pretty good for 53. So I'd, yeah. I'd totally do it. I would. Yeah. Yeah. Would. Problem solved. I'm there. Yeah. But you know she's not a dude. She'll take it in the bus still, right? Johnny <laughs> Bus. Genie Bus. Yeah. You gotta ask Phil. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta ask Phil. Yeah. You want Jimmy Bus. No, no, no. I want I want to fuck your wife, but only in the butts. <laughs> Deal. Only. I'll spread the word. I'm like, I'll spread the word you that Melo is a superstar <laughs> if you let me fuck her in the butts. You know, <laughs> with our fan base and all. He's like, I'll take whatever I can get. Yeah, yeah, take what you can get. So can she. Uh, <laughs> and then uh, Kobe. Kobe's shooting a career low, a 37.7% shooting. I just said shooting too many times. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's uh, it's It's been a rough couple of seasons for the Lakers. I'm blaming this. On Mike D'Antoni. <laughs> yeah. I agree. It's still his it's, fault. It's D'Antoni's yeah. fault. It's his fault that Kobe got injured last season in the yep. first place, right? And the yes. season before. And the season before. So uh, this is still D'Antoni's fault that Kobe's only shooting 37.7, mm-hmm. which is his worst season ever. And it's his fault that Kobe's getting older. That's that's also his yeah. fault. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fucking he, he Mike took D'Antoni Kobe controls out of his prime. time and he's making Kobe older. He took Kobe out of his prime and, and hurt his knee and his ankle oh, and Achilles. Asshole. Fucking Dan He's Tony. a dick. Uh, you know, we talked about this on last week's show. Seems like it was just an hour ago. That Swaggy P told Kobe, 
solution is give me the ball. Fast week. Yeah, <laughs> give me the ball. I'll I'll shoot it for yeah. you. Is Swaggy P the answer? <laughs> no. So, uh, someone's got to be. Yeah, I mean, yeah. someone's got to shoot the give ball. Give a brother a chance, like I said. I mean, because nobody else is going to shoot the ball. Look, Iggy no. Azalea gave him a chance, and that's some high ass pussy right there. <laughs> some high <laughs> ass pussy? <laughs> Don't you know what that means? She's the star of White Chicks. That's right. <laughs> what is high ass pussy? <laughs> high end pussy is what I meant. Oh. But I was thinking of ass still. Anyways, I think we all know the real answer. We're here talking about practice. Yeah, yeah. Alan Iverson, the answer. Yeah. See, they're talking about practice. Kobe talks during practice, and he gets no practice in. No, these motherfuckers are shitty. Yeah. I think he said something like that. Soft as shit. Soft as toilet paper. Charmin. Charmin. <laughs> right. When did he turn into an 85-year-old black man? Shit. Shaman. <laughs> Shadow. Shadow Star Galactica. Thanks, Black Dwight. Yes. <laughs> yes. Black Dwight. Uh, <laughs> Bears beats. Dallas Star Galactica. Anyways, uh, in honor of the Lakers and all of their losses, as as we said, uh, this is a holiday show. We have some holiday music, and uh, this is one of the ones I'm most proud of. <laughs> Here is old show time. to 70. This game's in the Admiral refrigerator. The door is closed. The light's out. Butter's getting hard. The eggs are cooling and the jello is jiggling. Been jiggling for a long time. <laughs> Can I say that when I was putting that together last night, a couple of tears brought to eye. Yeah. <laughs> Not only do we miss chick. the days, I miss ch- days of old show time, but we miss the days of old Chick Hearn. Yeah. I told your chick to get out because you're masturbating to Chick Hearn tonight. Don't, hey, can you not ruin this for us? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. We're all over here a little With little your tears. Sad. Thank you. Okay. Uh, now I could use the tissue. I know that. That was That's beautiful. Right. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I wrote that myself. <laughs> you could use great singers. Sing? Yeah, well, right? uh, sure. Why not? <laughs> Did you sing that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Seriously, you're gonna play mine after that shit? Yeah, this yours is sucks. not fair. No, it's not. My lyrics are clever, but Sad. my my voice is not. Nope. <laughs> no. Nope. Never. No, that was a good Never one. Never my voice. But honestly, editing the 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 at first I was like, oh, this is a good song. I like this one. And then when I edited in the chick clips, I was like. This is sad. Yeah. I miss Chick. It was good, good. It was. Now all we got left is fucking Stu Lance. Yeah. I am sad. I am. I miss Chick. I miss Jerry. Yep. Because. Uh, Both Jerry's. Yeah. Jerry! Jerry and Jerry, man. They they were the two geniuses. And even, you know, and, yeah, you know, I don't want to cry in my beer. But, uh, <laughs> no one does. I don't think his kids are going to be able to do it. No. Uh, hey, if they give all control to Genie. She's, it starts with a J as well. So, I know. So does the son. But so we does Jimmy. We forget about him. him. Yeah, we forget about him. Jimmy is. What? Yeah. This is like the glory years for me as a Suns fan watching the Lakers suck. So, 
And the sun's not doing a whole lot better. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah woo! Yeah, the sun's barely all, yeah. to go back. All to. I yeah. can expect from the suns is to do better than the Lakers while they suck. <laughs>